coming to sow the, the seed, the master seed. And what is this master seed? The master seed this time we're carrying is the seed of wealth creation, emanating from our theme of securing your future. As you know, all of you who did mobilize for NRM in the last election, our theme was securing your future. So the, the master said, I want to come to every sub-region and walk the talk. How can we secure the future of our people? So he directed us that we should do a non-political, but a wealth creation mobilization. Because he wants to come and pass his message. He's been passing the message of four acre model. He moved from the four acre model, he went to wealth creation, or WC. Before the WC, he brought NADS. Before NADS, there was Itandikwa. Before Itandikwa, there was Nusaf 1. Before Nusaf 1, the, the, after Nusaf 1, there is Nusaf 2. All this, there is the Dr. D. All these programs came here, but we are still the least developed country, region. Northern Uganda as a whole is the least developed region. Why? He needs to understand why. So we have come to come and get the answer. Our master's question will be, session will be interactive. He will not ask you the leaders, he's going to ask the local person in the village, have you received the parish development model money? Cow. If the answer will be no, I don't know what the master will do to you. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want you, you to suffer the same fate of like other people. And this is not the cow of Obongi alone, because it is for the whole of Madi. Every cow will be asked a question. And therefore, the PDM money should at least have reached the people. He wants to understand infrastructure issues. He wants to understand issues of service delivery among all the other government development programs that we have spent. Why is it that there are some few people who are eating the money? Because there are people who are in Inyoga, PDM, uh, Nusaf 1, Nusaf 2, even when we bring Nusaf 10, they will be there. They are the only ones. Kuliagiri Anguna, Kuliagiri Anguna. Everything is you, 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 one person. This is because at the beginning of this term of office, President General Yoel Museveni gave specific directives for wealth creation. One of them was directed to Uganda Investment Authority, which is to create 25 industrial parks across the country. We came to West Nile, uh, we managed to secure 500 acres of land at Nebi, or in Nebi district, just on the roadside. We came to Yumbe, we managed to secure 1,200 acres of land for a major premier industrial park. We also managed to get 500 acres from Madi Okoro. So what brings us here is to ensure that the business community, the value addition champions of Obongi, of Wajumani, of all of West Nile, become the next generation big investors. President's visit is not political. He's coming for West Crescent and it is developmental oriented that yes, he's coming to visit us. So the visit we should regard it regardless of party. He is coming to visit us as people of Madisa region. We have issues to be tabled to him as Madisa region, not NRM. So if we have our issues of NRM, we shall also go through the minister and the state house controller that my minister will need to visit the president in in the state house. house. That is where we shall go and visit the president and table our issues of party via the secretary general of the party. So this time around, the visit is for everyone. He's coming to see how far have we progressed economically. How are people doing in their households? Are people in position to get one dollar in a day? Those are the issues that we need to discuss and table in front of him. How far have you raised us as far as Imyoga is concerned and PDM in the district? These are some of the issues that we need to put into consideration. Let's put the political affiliation aside. Let's focus on the visit and we need to mobilize people regardless of the party. But we really want uh, to ensure that the domestic investors from this region are the anchors of our industrial parks here. So you always hear international investors. No, we want uh, people from uh, West Nile to be 
the, the value addition champions be running the industries in these industrial parks. So this is the message we want to give you and UIA will stand behind you. We want to tell you what you need to do, what UIA can do to support you to become an industrialist, to add value to your products and ensure the industrialized region. President Mutua is surely all the regions in the country, so you have to make sure that you mobilize the so that you don't ashamed is a zone of yours. Really, you have not to ashamed and to add on what the Honorable Member of Parliament said, you should not critique this work because it is fitting uh, something to do with poverty and education, wealth education, and that, that does not discriminate anybody. It helps your household. So you should not put politics in it. Please mobilize whoever can come so that people can learn how to get out of poverty. For the side, on the side of logistics, uh, logistics, we give equal funds to all the districts and the host districts and other districts. And these funds were really uh, budgeted by the president. You know. <laughs>